All right. Fuzzed pie guy here. You're looking at the uh, atomic pie with the breakout board on it. And I have a Raspberry Pi 4, 4 gig uh, set in here. Now I got Ethernet hooked up to both. And this RFID is for another project, so we won't worry about it. But I just want to see how many watts the Pi 4 draws versus how many watts the Atomic Pi draws. And to do that, I have my USB cable here for my Pi 4. Then I have a short USB cable here hooked into the uh, breakout board on the Pi, the Atomic Pi. So if we come over here, I have one of these watt meters. And right now you can see it's not drawing nothing. So we're not using no wattage. So we're gonna go ahead and plug in the Pi 4. <clears throat> and we'll just give it some time to boot up. So we got power, as you can see. So now if we go over here, let me back up a little bit. So right now we're drawing 0 0.05 of an amp at 3.1 watts. Now let me get back here. So we'll just focus more on the wattage, be easy to monitor. So right now we're still in the three watt range. So we'll just let it run here a second till it boots up a little bit. And I'm running the uh, full version of uh, Raspbian on it. So it's got the desktop and all. So right now, we are at anywhere from 3.3 uh, watts 2.8 watts up to 3.9 depending now there's no load on it there's nothing running or whatever so <clears throat> so we're using up to we'll just say 4.1 watts at times depending but like right now it's set and idle and we're pulling in about three three and a half watts low is 2.8 all right so let's go ahead and try our atomic pie so as of right now we're not drawing nothing so we'll go ahead and plug it in we have power so we'll move back over to here let me get it back to watts we're drawing point six of an amp and we're at four watts four and a half now i'm running uh linux 64 bit uh operating system on the atomic pi with a desktop and all so so we're up to 5.5 .5 watts six seven <clears throat> hanging around five to six so we'll give it another second or two here to kind of level out a little because these atomic pies take a little a little bit longer to boot up they're not the fastest things to boot up but So right now we're kind of leveling out around 4.6, 4.8 watts. So it kind of gives you a ballpark of what these two draw. I mean, the Atomic Pie, it's definitely bigger in size, but overall it doesn't draw very much more. You know, at least maybe a watt, watt and a half more than the uh, Raspberry Pi 4. So pretty interesting so thought I'd make this video and share it to kind of help some people out so thanks for watching stay tuned for another one don't forget to hit the like share and subscribe button